my name is Tammy Taminaga, I'm 17 years old, I'm from Sao Paulo, Brazil, and I have four minutes to expose my deepest hope for my generation. If I asked you, what is hope for you, what would you answer? If you look up in the dictionary, you're going to find more than 15 definitions. Optimism, desire, wish, expectation, because hope is such an abstract idea. However, for me, hope has to do with philanthropy, which in the Greek concept means the love of humankind, the ability that every human being has to be and do something greater than themselves. Love translated into action, the commitment with the other, the feeling of seeing yourself in the eyes of another human being, the sense of one, where it doesn't matter your skin color, your nationality, your financial condition, your gender, your religion, only one and unique characteristic, our humanity. And this condition has the power to make us equal and worthy. Therefore, for me, the current problems faced in the world are fruit of this loss of the sense of humanity and consequently equality. So what are my hopes for the future? I would say that I believe in our human's condition to be world's healer, our ability to surpass our differences and extract the best of each one of them. And this starts with equal rights. I believe in equal rights between men and women. In the beginning of the 20th century, women from all over the world started fighting for their suffrage, the right to vote. In Brazil, only in 1932, women got the right to act politically. In Britain, in 1918, and in the United States, in 1920. Consequently, I'm only standing here competing to win an academic trip thanks to thousands of women before me, who opened the way with so much effort, struggle, and determination so girls like me could be here in this position right now. We women have a right to vote in most countries nowadays, but our fight continues. According to the United Nations, 200 million girls are missing in the world due to what is called gender side. Many girls grow up to face extreme aggression. Many have been neglected, abused, murdered, abandoned and wanted just because of their gender. Therefore, my hope is that in the same way women conquer the right to vote, I believe that each year we're gonna be closer and closer to gender equality and to the respect of the human dignity. I believe in the rise of future inspiring women like Malala, Mahiko He, and Nisi Augusta. I'm proud of being a volunteer and serving a non-governmental Brazilian organization called I Know My Rights, dedicated to take care of refugee children from Venezuela, Middle East and Africa. Thereby, I'm constantly in touch with families that had their human rights completely violated. Never in history there has been such a significant exodus. So this is a worldwide challenge. Children are children, no matter their nationality, skin color or religion. They deserve love care and the opportunity to live with dignity. As it is a global problem, it should have a global solution. I know it is not easy, but it's possible. And this is hope. We can and we will build bridges and find solutions to the impassable large gaps of prejudice and differences. Together, we can make it real. In conclusion, I believe in education as a tool to overcome all these challenges, as a powerful path to change a generation's mentality, providing the necessary values and understandings of our humanities and each one's duty towards equal rights. So let's cultivate our love for humankind today so we can reap better fruits tomorrow. This is my hope. Thank you.